guys welcome back with the fortnite doomsday event being right around the corner we are starting to see secret changes across our fortnite map to do with this event with the appearance of the doomsday machine we have now discovered a mind-blowing secret that will change fortnite forever guys we're getting into all of it in this video so you're really not gonna want to miss it all right guys let's waste no more time let's do this Yo, my Midas is almost fully golden. Yo, he looks sick. Hey, yo, is your Midas all golden? Let me know in the comment section below. And if it's not all golden, then uh, then keep it to yourself because I don't care. <laughs> Guys, welcome back to Fortnite. Welcome back to Doomsday in Fortnite. Today's video is going to be crazy because we're going to be revealing something that not everybody knows. I mean, quite literally, nobody knows this. Think of your favorite YouTuber or streamer or Fortnite personality. Think of that person. I can guarantee you that person does not know what you're about to find out in this video. Unless, of course, that person is me. Hey, and if I'm not your favorite YouTuber, hey, I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> we have to be talking about the Doomsday Machine. We've actually talked about the Doomsday Machine a bunch in this season so far. Hey, but just to recap, for those who haven't been following along, you know, for those who've been messing about, you know, for those who've been goofing around, not paying attention to the storyline. <laughs> I literally thought you were a baddie. My bad, bro. <gasps> oh, you're a baddie, though. Ah! Oh, my goodness, dude. That timing was insane. Yo, I don't often get lucky in Fortnite. I left that bunker at the right time. My goodness. The Doomsday Machine was this mysterious machine that has been making an appearance in Fortnite and in the Battle Pass. Players have reported seeing wires inside their Battle Pass, and leakers have even revealed what this machine will look like through leaks and things like that. Well, it seems we know right now where this Doomsday Machine is going to appear, the exact location, and what it now might be used for in this future Doomsday Fortnite event. I'm gonna have to quickly deal with this guy. This guy's really bugging me. Yo, bro, leave me alone, bro. You know what they say about cornering a fox? Don't ever corner a fox, because it's gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> Man, come on. Yo, I wish I could get a little icon above my head saying, leave this guy alone. He's making a video. Don't attack this guy unnecessarily. Please and thank you. For us to locate the position of the Doomsday Machine, we actually have to go all the way back to one of my favorite seasons, Season 9. Back in Fortnite in Season 9, we had what was known as the Monster Events. The Giant Polar Peak Monster. I might have talked about that once or twice, I don't know. And of course, the Mecha Team Leader Robot. And we know in the final events between the robots and the monster that the robots managed to find a secret weapon hidden underneath the statue statue in the center of what was Neo Tilted. Epic Games loves to hide things underneath statues and it turns out in this season, season 2, that things aren't any different. <gasps> that guy's got a rocket launcher. What the but now back in chapter 2, season 2 of Fortnite, where is the Doomsday Machine and why are we talking about statues? Well, something that we know about the Doomsday Machine right now, Jonesy. What a trap. Who would do this? One thing we know about the Doomsday Bunker so far is it's missing something on top. There seems to be some kind of round ball that seems to be missing from the top, right? Right? Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think we might have just figured out what that ball is that is going to be on top of this doomsday machine. And it has something to do with this statue. I mean, you guys think about it. We had the same in season nine. There was something underneath the statue. And it's going to be no different this season of season two. There is this random statue in the middle of one of the most important locations in the game. We have a random ball with the ghost agency logo on top. And of course, course, the main character himself, Midas, as a statue. At this point, it is basically confirmed that the center of the agency is going to change. We know Deadpool is underneath, and we know the Doomsday Machine is hidden under the ground right now. So, what it seems like is going to happen, at some point, the Doomsday Machine is going to be set up right here. It has four corners, exactly the same number of sides and legs that the Doomsday Machine has. 
it will be placed right in the middle and the mysterious ball that is on top might just be this. Hey, now look, I'm not just saying it's the ball. There's probably something inside this ball that is super crazy and interesting. You know, like some kind of piece of technology or something, something to do with Doomsday. I don't know what it is right now. Uh, this is probably going to be opened up, this ball right here. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Hey, how's it going, bro? And I mean, think about it. We already know the agency is going to be changing in a lot of different ways, right? We've already discussed the fact that we know the agency is going to flood at some point this season. So maybe what's going to happen is the agency floods and Midas has to take his doomsday machine to the surface and place it directly in the center of the agency. Whatever's gonna happen, ah, I don't quite know yet, but we know it's got something to do with Doomsday, the Doomsday hatches, Deadpool, the Doomsday bunker. Oh, there is just so much going on. There's so much to talk about. It's crazy. Yo, Deadpool, what's you doing to that guy down there? Woo! Hey, he wasn't expecting that one. That was a showdown of the ages. Yo, I just forgot that we're sick at this game. Hey, what? Yo, what? I, what? Yo, I just dumpstered that guy. Completely trash bag. I don't know how I'm out the game right now. My reticle was on him. I did more damage than he did. I, that that might have to be another mystery. I'll add that to the list. The Doomsday Bunker, Oro and Midas, and of course, the mystery of the default. Man, that is garbo, dude. Okay, guys, guys, it's time for a serious conversation. We're about to get pretty serious. So if you don't like serious conversations, uh, I don't know. Cut the music. Guys, do I say guys too much? You know what I mean? Like, 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 guys, you know? Bro, we're having a moment over here. Do you mind? Stupid. You guys know what I mean? When I say guys, you know, like guys, guys, guys. Somebody said to me the other day that I say guys too much. I say guys a lot. And you know what? You might be right. You might be right. I just wanted to take a moment to say that I acknowledge it. I see and hear what you're saying. And I wanted to make a public statement today to address this issue and to officially say that I don't care, guys. I'm gonna say guys forever. Guys, 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 guys. The Doomsday Mystery is not yet over. We might have discovered the future location of the Doomsday Machine, but we still don't yet know what it is going to be doing in our game. And of course, what does Doomsday mean for Fortnite? Something that is extremely interesting and worth knowing is we find out there is a code name for the ending of each season. Let me give you an example. In uh, season 10 on our chapter one island, the final event was called Night Night. That was the code name for the final event of that season. The code names have always been code names. They've never really described exactly what is going to be happening. And they've also not been that scary. I mean, what does Night Night actually mean? But the event's code name for this season is Doomsday. Now, there isn't really two ways that you can take that. I mean, Doomsday in Fortnite. I mean, that doesn't sound like a good thing, you know? <laughs> so the question is, are we really going to be getting some kind of Doomsday in Fortnite? Or is this code name designed to mislead us? Well, as always, we actually have a pretty good theory. Come get some. <laughs> I don't think you have any idea how fast I really am. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, meowsu has got me out here playing like a pro. You see those edits? Yo, what is the reverse of Doomsday? Well, you would probably think that Doomsday in Fortnite would suggest the end of Fortnite. But of course, we've just had the end of Fortnite. So it's not like we're really about to lose the map again. So what is the opposite of Doomsday? Instead of losing our Fortnite map, maybe we're about to get another Fortnite map? Possibly? I've had a bunch of people messaging me online saying that recently epic games actually added in the old fortnite map 
back into the game's files. Well, at least it was the image of the map, kind of like the image you would get on your mini map. This is hotly debated right now whether this is a leak or whether this is something that has just been added in for an LTM or for whatever purpose. It is kind of possible that in this doomsday event in Fortnite that this is not going to be the doom. doomsday of our <laughs> Fortnite <laughs> island. It's actually going to be the opposite. A rebirth of our old Fortnite island. What if it's possible that this new device that is being built at the agency is actually going to somehow reopen our old Fortnite island? The last doomsday that came to our Fortnite game oh, no, no, took no, away no. our <laughs> island. So maybe this time, this doomsday in Fortnite is actually going to bring it back. <laughs> <laughs> What were you doing, my guy? Yo, is there a helicopter above me? Ah! Oh, yo, what's good? Ah! No, that wasn't the easiest fight to watch. It may look like I was completely out of control and out of my depth, but uh, um, but 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 fifth place is still better than your last game. You already know, dude. He had a rocket launcher. There was nothing I could have done. There was nothing I could have done. Come on, man. Ugh. With more information about the Doomsday event coming to Fortnite, what do you think is about to go down in the next couple of weeks? Guys, I would love to know. Let me know in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you guys do want to support this channel, you can do so by using the supporter creator code that is on screen right now. And apart from that, thanks again, guys. And I'll catch you all on the next Season 2 Fortnite video. All right, guys. Peace.